when the giant hippopotamus gets angry. Would you be surprised, dear viewer, if you saw a lion attacking and preying on a hippopotamus? The answer will certainly be no. Because lions are predators and it is normal for them to attack other animals. But what if the situation changed and the prey became the hunter and the hunter became the prey? In this clip you will see the hippopotamus is the hunter and the lion is the prey. You will also see many other animals that will be crushed by hippopotamus so follow us to the end. Hippopotamus is a peaceful anima, it is a herbivorous animal. Most of the time it becomes prey to a lot of predators. But what if the hippopotamus used its powerful jaw to defend itself and attack predators? This is my dear viewer what you will see in today's clip. In this clip, a herd of hippopotamus brutally attacks a crocodile with their powerful jaws. In another clip, when one of the lionesses tried to approach the hippopotamus, the response was strong and fast. Then crushed the lioness's head with the jaw of the deadly hippopotamus. Hippopotamus attacked a group of hyenas to protect a young deer. The hippopotamus also uses its jaw to defend itself against the wild buffalo and keep the danger away from him. Two crocodiles managed to catch the legs of a wild buffalo. It was dragged into the water to be controlled, drowned, and eaten as a dinner meal. But the hippopotamus had a different opinion. The hippopotamus intervened to rescue the buffalo from between the bone-breaking teeth of crocodiles. They succeeded in doing so and the buffalo managed to escape with serious injuries. A herd of hyenas trapped a hippopotamus by a pond. They wait for the right opportunity to prey on, but the hippopotamus will not give up easily. With his jaw he managed to defend himself and survive the attack of hyenas on him. No hyena could get close to him for fear of his deadly jaw. The hyenas chased the hippopotamus for long distances, but to no avail as well. The hippopotamus remained vigilant and prepared. Hippopotamus versus Rhinoceros The rhinoceros uses its pointed horn to move away from the deadly jaw of a hippopotamus. It's normal to see a crocodile chasing a hippopotamus. But in this clip you will see the hippopotamus, which is the fisherman. He will chase the crocodile in a pool of water and then some crocodile will kill him in the end. This hippopotamus did not survive the lion's deadly fangs, but the lion did not enjoy his meal because of the little hippopotamus. Who came to defend his father with all strength and ferocity?